Okay, so we're at the Sea Point Promenade and it's about an 11 kilometer stretch. You can come for a run or exercise, whatever you want. Um, are we going for a run today? No. No, yes. Well, I'm supposed to have my hiking shoes on, but I don't. I might catch the sunset. The Sea Point Promenade is a melting pot of nationalities from around the world and South Africa. It's a place where locals and tourists gather to exercise, picnic on the beach, or meet up with friends. During the summer months, salsa dancing and yoga events take place. You can even spot paragliders landing here all the way from Signal Hill. You can hire a bike, take your dog for a walk, or go for a nice fresh ocean breeze run. One of the reasons I keep coming back is to observe the beautiful sunset. You could come here every day of the week and you'd get a kaleidoscope of colours and patterns of the sky. Almost sunset time, I'm going to try and record like when the sun goes down. And yeah, those late night sunsets are starting to happen already. So there's a cloud blocking the sunset, so you won't get like a proper full sunset. This is on the other side. I just couldn't resist doing it because um, I've got such a love for astronomy but that's the actual moon we've got a full moon tonight um, and yep those photons took about 1.3 seconds to get to our eyeballs how awesome is that So this is the infamous rhinosaur. What you've got to do is you've got to sort of peep through this hole and a rhino image will start to form. I think it's already starting to form as you can see. And if you move left or right, the image will distort. So I'm going to try and move right and you'll see that the image distorts. And if I go left, it will sort of form again and then slowly distort again. That's Table Mountain in the background and just look how amazing that looks. I'll try and zoom in a bit. So once you've soaked up all the fresh air from the Sea Point Promenade, a good way to end the evening would be to go to a place called Mojo Market. To describe Mojo Market in a nutshell, I'd say it's like the local watering hole. Mojo Market offers a wide variety of foods, including pizzas, burgers, and even oysters. It's got a vibrant energy with live bands, and it's just the place to put you in the weekend mood. such a warm day in Cape Town today um, it seems like the cold is really gone for good this time um, we are on our way to get some breakfast at a place called Signal Gun not Signal Hill but Signal Gun we've never been there before um, we've come through to a few places in Durbanville uh, Mirandal, Boschendal and then Tables at Natida which is one of my favorites but we thought we'd try something new today and just see what it's like so I'll let you guys know how it goes when we get there. So Les is one of those people that the minute they wake up, they have to have something to eat. She has breakfast the second she wakes up. Um, I can go quite long, uh, like maybe an hour or so before I need to eat anything. But yeah, how are you doing? I'm Cut? starving oh, right well, now. Basically mm. starving. So do you yeah, know what you want for breakfast? Everything. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
signal gun is nested in the Durban Vol vineyard. They've got your traditional breakfast with an extensive menu and a relaxed environment. places that I occasionally like to drive up. Um, if you're lucky enough to stay in Simonstown, it's one of the ways if you're coming from Musenberg side you can either go through Main Road or through Boys Drive. But why I like Boys Drive is that it's just got one of the most amazing panoramic ocean views. So on one side you've got um, the ocean where you can see Simonstown, a bit of Fisher, and on the other side you can, you've got just this gorgeous mountain that's staring at you. Uh, Boys Drive is also popular for shark spotting, so when we get up there you'll see there's like a shark spotter hut and they look out for any sharks. Um, if they spot a shark, uh, they just make anyone aware at the bottom. Um, Musenberg is quite a popular place for surfers as well. So yeah, I'll check in with you guys once I get to the top. So this is the one side, you've got this awesome mountain and this is the road that comes up and then on the other side, as I said the water's a bit choppy today but still beautiful. all the way to the top I can't see any sharks today but really awesome view from here So this time around I'm going to try and go back the other way, so not boys drive, I'll go through main road um, and show you that it's just as beautiful. show you something really cool so I've come to the bottom of the main road just remember we were at boys drive a few minutes ago so I just want to show you the view from the bottom so this is the view from the bottom so I think we were somewhere like there or could have been there or I might not be the exact spot but it was somewhere that side so that's the top of boys and we at the bottom and this is the other side of the view. 